Hi everyone, my name is Miss M and you are watching my first ever YouTube directed drawing video. So as you can see, I'm still working on my intro and I wanna try and put some music in with that, but I really wanted to get a video up before Memorial Day for my students. So speaking of Memorial Day, anytime that I think of Memorial Day, I always think of a barbecue. So today we're going to be making a hamburger and a hot dog, but we're gonna make them really cute. So let's start with our hamburger first. I'm using a Sharpie just so that you can see my lines better. But if you wanna use a pencil first, in case you make any mistakes, they're easier to erase. So over here, we're going to start with a curved line. After your curved line, you're going to add a line that comes right across. And if I'm ever moving too fast, you can always pause the video so you can catch up. After that, I'm going to add a wavy line that comes all the way across. That's our lettuce for our cheeseburger. After that, I'm going to add two lines that come down at the sides and a line straight across. Then we're going to add our hamburger patty. So instead of making it just a straight line, we're going to add a little bit of like a wiggle to it. So I'm just kind of wiggling my Sharpie a little bit just to get that texture in there. Then I'm going to add my favorite part, the cheese. So I'm gonna have a line come down at a diagonal and then go back up at a diagonal just to show the corner of the cheese. And the bottom bun is last. So two lines down, and then I'm going to connect it with a little curve just so it looks rounded. All right. We are almost done, but we're gonna add a few extra details. Let's give our cheeseburger some really cute eyes. So, first we're going to start with two big circles. One and two. And you could try your best to make them about the same size. After you have your two circles, we're going to add two more in the middle, but we're going to have them go off to the side a little bit. So watch first. Then I'm going to add another little circle to make the highlight in the eye to kind of make them look shiny. So another little circle like this. And then you could color in this circle right here. And again, if you ever feel like I'm moving too fast, you can always pause the video to catch up. And we're gonna give him a little smile. I'm also going to add some sesame seeds on my bun. So I'm going to make little teardrop shapes like this. And you can add as many as you'd like. Last but not least, we're going to give him two little legs. So I'm going to make two slanted lines or diagonals, two diagonals. And I'm just going to give him two oval feet like this. One, two. All right. Now that we finished our hamburger, we're going to move over to our hot dog. So this one's going to be a little different. We're going to start with the eyes first. So watch, I'm going to start with a circle like this 
And then I'm going to attach the second eye right next to it. So I'm going to add the next circle attached like that. And we're going to do the eyes very similar to how we did the cheeseburger's eyes. We're going to do a circle inside, but this time you see how we put the circle on the left side? That's because we want him to be looking at our cheeseburger. So one, two, and we can also add the little highlight, same way we did in our cheeseburger, and then color in. One, two. All right, after that, we're going to start with the bun. So watch first, then do it. We're gonna make a long oval next to the eyes, but not touching. This is going to be part of the bun. And then we can add the actual hot dog. So watch, I'm going to come a little bit taller than my bun, and I'm gonna come up around and hit the eye, and then continue it underneath. That's the hot dog. And then we can add the other side of the bun connected to the hot dog. And we're going to give him a different kind of smile than our cheeseburger. I'm gonna make his mouth open. So watch, line across the top and a U shape underneath. And we can also add a little curve in the mouth to make it look like his tongue inside there. And I'm gonna color in the rest of the mouth. We're going to give him two legs I'm gonna have two lines that come out straight from the bottom with two little ovals for the feet. And I think we're gonna give the hot dog some arms and hands too, so watch. We're gonna make him look like he's so excited. Let's do a diagonal line up, coming from the middle of the bun. And then on this side, we're going to have it come out from the side of the bun. So two little arms, and we'll give him some oval fingers. One, two, and I'm gonna color them in. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And we can also color in the feet too, black. All right, now that we've finished our cheeseburger and our hot dog, we're going to color. So I'm going to use crayons today to color my artwork in. You can use whatever type of materials you would like. I'm going to speed up the video for this part, but um, you can, again, always pause the video if you would like to follow along with my coloring. All right, thank you guys so much for following along with me and watching this video. Again, I know I still have some improvements to make with my intro and everything else, but um, I hope everyone has a great Memorial Day weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye.